Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make those super cool Benji's Adventures rocks that you see in all of his videos and you saw in his movie park and even in his new parks. You do need disable collisions, so make sure you have that. Make sure to stay to the end of this video to see how to make these rocks to improve your parks. Okay, so first we're going to have to do some terrain stuff. So we'll go down here to terrain and then we'll go paint terrain and I'm just going to paint all of the area that you want your mountain. My mountain is going to be pretty small, so we'll do something like this. Just like a kind of small area where my mountain will be and then next we're going to go to edit terrain height right here and then just kind of put the base of your mountain i want the tip of the mountain to be right there and then just have some other little mountain pieces like this maybe i'll make this a little lower it'll look blocky at the beginning but it will look super good at the very end until you have a really good shape of a mountain kind of like that next you're going to go down here to scenery and then go to primitives you're going to have the very first one that already selects for you and you're going to place that down just anywhere that is not where your mountain is going to be and you're going to exit out and now what you want to do is press the picker icon and then while holding shift press on that block next we're going to be dragging this block over here and then go into your item snapping settings where these little nine dots are with the little magnet right here and then go down to no snapping for rotation snapping and then same for move snapping go to no snapping start with our first rock right here try to use these little rings around it to just move it around don't make it all just squares into the normal grid and then just place it down in some corners like this so if you see a corner like this just make sure to place it down you can even use this green ring to make it go down a little bit and then I'm gonna press G on my keyboard to place it down now before you continue go to painter paint it the color of rock you want it usually I would do like this color and then you would go down here to rock and then check this button right here go back to picker shift and press on that now you don't have to worry about painting it because it's already painted when you see these corners like this try to fill it in with these blocks kind of like that lower it so it's not on the same level as these other two so lower it like that or make it higher I'm gonna lower it and press G I'm just gonna fill in these empty corners just like this kind of move it around and try to make a lot of these blocks everywhere so we're gonna do in front of that and now we're gonna do on top right here make sure these blocks never glitch together so if they were like really close together they would glitch or overlap like this make sure you don't do that so I'm just gonna kind of adjust this to my likings make sure to keep using these rings to move it around and then just do that for the entire thing and you will see how good your landscaping looks so right now I'm gonna just really quickly finish this side of the mountain make sure there's no little grass parts that are showing in between these blocks and we're just gonna rotate it around you got to make it look really messy just like I am showing you right here adjust it randomly as you go through this so I'm just gonna really quickly make this little mountain right here and have these clumped rocks if it looks kind of like this you don't really like it you can start clumping a couple more rocks together and just make it look as natural as you can one eternity later all right so I have my rocks placed down for this side of the mountain and next what I'm going to do is pick on one of these rocks just any rock on here and then come to the search bar and then you want to type bush this will give you these bushes right here these are the exact ones you want do not add too many but kind of make them pop out of the rocks just a little bit like this to make it look a little more like jungly like there's moss on the rocks make sure to not have the entire thing showing like this but some of it just coming out of the rocks like that i'll do one more down here really quick so now you have some little green parts sticking out of the rocks as well next what you would do is just fill the rest of the mountain with these rocks and you have this really detailed benji's adventures mountains another thing that you can do that makes your park to look really good using these Benji's Adventures rocks is that if you had just like a little pond or something like this let's fill this with water it looks kind of bad to have these like rough edges over here so what you would want to do is grab one of these rocks like this you want to drag it and fill in all of the corners that look like they have grass on it. so all these that have grass on it just fill them up with rocks like this make sure you rotate them a lot and kind of just move them up and down you don't want them to be super like uniform just like straight in a line you want them to be all jagged all around like this so then it looks really natural but if you do want grass you can put those bushes in later now after a little bit more of these rock placing it looks a lot more natural like there's more just like nature around this if you want you can keep adding some rocks to the back of them like this that'll make it even look more natural but I'm not gonna waste a ton of that time if you want to do it you are welcome to that's gonna be it for this entire video if you enjoyed it and you learned something from it or you use some of these things go leave a like down below and if you like content and tutorials or even park showcases like this go and subscribe down below thanks for watching and see you guys next time.